Hello YouTube and welcome to another car driving video gamey video sort of thing. Uh, keeping with the Codemasters theme lately, now with Dirt 3. Uh, I think this is one of their most recent games actually. Got it on Steam during a Humble Bundle last year. And it's quite fun. Uh, let's jump right in. Single player game. Uh, it's a single race. Uh, let's do, yeah, Trailblazer in Kenya. Yes, uh, let's go with a classic car in the morning. All right, Toyota Tacoma, an Audi Quattro. Let's go with the Audi. Sure. As you can tell, I haven't played the game much. Oh well. Okay, as usual, I'm racing with a Logitech Momo uh, for shifting. I'm using the uh, up down sticky shiftery thingy on the left and not the paddles. Kenya, yes, it's Kenya, we all know. Ah, the majestic Audi Quattro. Race! Alright, there's another Quattro. Seems I chose the right car for the gerb. Okay, so, this game, uh, it's quite good. I really, really, really like it. It's not a hardcore simulation. It's nowhere close to hardcore simulation. But, it is so much fun. The, the force feedback and the like are realistic enough to make you feel like you're actually doing something and not just playing a video game. But, not quite as good as Richard Burns Rally, which is pretty much the benchmark for absolutely everything. Physics, yeah. Basically, this car make this game makes you a much much better driver than you actually are. I could not do that in real life. Believe me, I've tried. <laughs> but yes, the uh, the force feedback is the best I've played in a modern game. You know, I'm not gonna count. You know, Richard Burns isn't modern. I mean, I'm gonna say modern being anything that natively supports 1080p widescreen. Shit! 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 Oh, I just died. Reverse. I also killed the car. <laughs> Good job, me. Okay, let's go. Let's... Um, but yes, the graphics are good. I have them turned down quite a bit uh, in order to actually record this. Where'd it go? Oh, water, apparently. In order to record this game, so usually there would have been a bunch of nice watery effects and stuff there, but there are not because my computer is a potato. Tree, rock, reverse. Killed the car again. Not sure how I keep doing that, considering I don't even have a clutch with what, with which to use to kill it. And wow, I've gotten really, really bad at this game. I haven't played this in a good eight months or so. And just, I was really, really good at this stage. That's why I'm playing it. I thought I'd do all right, but apparently I was wrong. But as I'm going around these corners, you know, the wheels, it's, it's not just a constant vibration. The wheel is randomly just kind of jerking around in my hand. I don't have another gear, do I? Nope. The wheel's just kind of jerking around in my hand uh, randomly as you would expect. Oh, through the thing, and right there it just got loose in the hand as I went around that. It stiffens up a bit in the corners. It's quite nice, actually. But the graphics, when they're turned up all the way, god, this game is pretty. And especially since you're moving so fast, that's the nice thing about racing games, is they don't have to have an insane amount of detail and stuff, because you're moving by it so quickly, and you're concentrating on other things, you don't have time to appreciate the scenery, because you're trying to go around a goddamn corner, and you keep doing that. God, I love how quickly these shift. So games can get away, so racing games can get away with having a lower level of detail than, you know, the latest AAA first-person shooter, Cough Cough Call of Duty, Cough Cough Battlefield, whatever the hell they're on now. I don't have a clutch pedal, I can't heel toe, it makes me sad. It's a technique I've always wanted to learn how to do. Someone want to buy me a G27 for Christmas? Ha 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 ha! Or better 
processor. Let's go. Oh, bush, bush, mine the shrubbery. Whoa, and I actually made it. Yay. And I got fourth. I crashed three times and I got fourth. Huh. Interesting. That's another thing about this game. The level of difficulty. I have it turned all the way up. Everything. All the way up. And I always, you know, when I don't... That was a really, really, really bad performance uh, by me. But I almost always podium. Even though everything's set to be really, really hard. So, on the level of di difficulty, it's, it's kind of easy. Except for the Gimkana stuff. I can't figure that out to save my life. Uh, yes! 800 horsepower Ford Fiesta. This can't possibly go wrong. That's, that's just ridiculous. 800 horsepower. Uh, it's like a Hellcat that can go around corners. And the engine's in the right spot. Those are brakes? Those were tiny little brakes. Yeah, those are tiny little brakes. Huh. Yay. Uh, another thing about this game, it is pretty well optimized, and all the loading screens and stuff are just brilliantly done. Like, the way that it faded into everything, and, you know, just the menus and stuff are really well thought out. I... It, it, ergonomics in game interfaces and how aesthetically pleasing they are isn't something that's generally given a lot of thought, since it's kind of tertiary to performance and just gameplay and graphics. Though, lots of modern games don't even seem to be giving that much thought lately. Wow, this... Oh, I turn here. But this game, it gets it right. So does uh, Grid, the another Codemasters game. And... I can't think of any of their other modern ones. Whoop! Whoop! Yup! Yep, love tap the... Uh, I really need to handbrake a bit more often. <laughs> Can block it up in here, sliding around corners. Not always the fastest way to do things, but it's definitely the most fun. Handbrake! And I was in the wrong gear. Whoa! There we go. Yeah, a bit of opposite lock, shifting way too early. Maybe I just need more practice. Whoop, whoop! Well, didn't see that. Oh, crap. Sure. Flashback. Oh, wait. Oh, God, I have no idea how these things work. Uh, F2? Yes, that rewinds me. Yes, yes. F1. Oh, no, that's not how it works. Okay, do I hit F9? Nope, that's not it. Escape? What do I do? Oh, F12. There we go. Okay. Turn a bit more. There we go. Uh, what am I doing? I can't... Okay, alright. Huh, that's interesting. That's that's a cool feature about this game that I kind of like. So that if you're having a good run and then you just screw up one thing, it doesn't. you don't have to redo your whole run. And you can kind of see how you would have done had you not botched it. Like I just did there. At the very end, nonetheless. Whoa! Seventh. Meh. Let's do something else. Let's do something rear-wheel drive. I suck at rear-wheel drive. That should be entertaining. Loading times are pretty good, though. I mean, this is just a desktop spinning disk hard drive. I don't have an SSD or anything exotic like that in here. So these, these loading times are pretty reasonable, I think, for a game of this size. Yay, um... Mm. This is the land rush. I'm not even sure what that is. But let's do it. Yes, yes. Trucks. Let's just make it two laps. In the snow. Um... Yes. Snow. 
Yes, yes, yes. I don't remember what a land rush is. I think it's just kind of a Baja thing. Yep, stadium trucks. Uh, sure. Yeah, I don't really know what any of those are. <laughs> but okay. Though I say reasonable loading times, then it takes quite a while for it to load here. I do like how is this is sort of like took a race driver and then it has a bit of different stuff. It has it's mostly rally though with some Gimkana, which I have absolutely no idea how the hell to do Gimkana type stuff. Oh, I can skip this. Yay. I might try that though, that'll be fun. Ha! <laughs> it's sixty-nine. Ha 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 five years old. Alrighty. Yeah! Let's race some truck- Oh! Oh, that dude just ran into me right off the bat. I can't see a damn thing. I should shift. I should downshift. I should do something. Dear lord. This is kind of chaotic. Okay, move. Move! I'm faster- <gasps> What?! Okay. Okay. Uh, couldn't hold that. Whoa! Hey, that guy did the same thing. <laughs> I'm still better than the computer. Not that that's saying much. Wow, force feedback, absolutely going nuts. I'm really glad this is just a Momo. If this was anything stronger, it'd probably be ripping the wheel out of my hands. I am weak. Okay, dive down. That's uh, not diving down. Oh, okay. Wow, why am I going so wide all the time? Let's try to tone it down a bit. Long back, a huge butt puckering jump. Power out of the corner, and shift. And that is a really bumpy section there for some reason. Scrub the corner completely. No, oh, that's probably that's coming out of my security deposit. Be so great if you could rent trucks like these. I'd totally rent one of these to go get the groceries in. Probably couldn't hold much. I mean, there's an engine where the bed should be. But hey, who cares? I mean, I'll go to a grocery store and buy two apples. Why the hell not? But compliment your enormous balls. Uh, truckio drifto. Is this almost done? I'm kind of bored of this already. This is not my thing. Well, oh, hey, there's a guy. Yay, I think that's the finish line. I was correct. I lost the front of my truck. And the back of my truck. How did that happen? <laughs> um... Yep, guess it's time for some Gimkanian and Gimkanikin. That stuff. The spinny, drifty, slidey, roundy, showy, offy stuff. Yep. LA Coliseum, sure. Olympic Field, sure. Um. Impreza, and Impreza, Fiesta. Oh, Lancer, yes. I love Lancers. June or NX Center. I have no idea what any of these sponsors are. I feel really out of touch right now. It's like, hello, kids. Do you, <laughs> do you want to go skateboards? Ah, uh, the Lancer. I honestly... I, I don't think many modern car designs are timeless, but I think the Lancer Evolution is a timeless design. And not just because they haven't changed it in the past 10 years. It's just a good looking car. Another timeless design would be the Jaguar XJS, which most of you probably know I have more than a small obsession wish with. What am I doing? What am I doing right now? Whoa! Well, hit that. Hit that! Ah, uh, that wasn't good. Oh, uh, there's gonna be some 
the slightly annoyed people. Shh. Yeah, smash. I can do that. Smashing things. Going under things. Oh, that's not the handbrake. That's downshift. <laughs> oh, that's... Or upshift, rather. I should probably have the automatic transmission for this. I don't know what I'm doing. Smashing things, I guess. Whoops! Okay. Let's... Let's... Not drift. Okay. Just trying to get the ass to come out, but it wouldn't. Come on, step out. I'm just understeering everywhere. Okay. Go around corner. Go around and corner. I'm already understeering. Go around corner. Now, handbrake. Yeah! No opposite lock, but I'm s going in a... I'm still understeering. More handbrake. More handbrake. More handbrake. Yeah. I love how my name is Player One. Let's, um... Uh... I think what I'm going to have to do for that, as much as I hate to, is switch to automatic transmission mode, because I cannot keep track of gears while trying to figure out an entirely new style of racing. So... Um... So let's do this somewhere else. Actually, is there something else? I think there was another... Nope, that's it. Okay. Uh, Memorial Park. Yeah, sure. I don't know what that is. Uh, let's do a different car. Something with more power. Okay. Sure. Traxxas. Oh, God. Yes, these loading screens are just amazing. I can stare at that. I don't mind. That ass. And with every douchebag brand ever invented all over it. I thought I'd show something other than the LA Coliseum. <laughs> okay, let's... Advanced settings... Da, 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 da. What the heck is Trickster? No idea. Okay, I guess I... Oh, wait. I guess I don't... Choose transmission there? No. <laughs> okay, do I do it from within the game? Pause. Options, controls... Ah, there we go. Automatic! Yay! Cuz... I'm lazy. Okay. Yeah! Alright, now I'm actually doing something. Whoa! Crap. God, this thing takes off. Up! Oh. Crap, crap! Well, I'm sliding, so, uh. Whoops. Man, screw what everyone else says. I don't care what place I get, I would have been impressed to see this. <laughs> Smashing things! Oh! Okay, missed him. Gotta go back. Got some of the things. Aw, oh, I was having fun! Okay, if I remember right, there is a gimkana y thing where you're in a, like, a, uh, shipyard, I think it is? 
I'm going to see if I can find that one. I think there was only two choices of venues. I think Monaco and something else. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Maybe it's Maybelline. I'm not sure. Let me see if I can find that, because that was that was a fun one. Uh, LA Coliseum. It's not either of those. Ah, there we go. Well, yeah, it's got to be that one. Yep, I liked that car. Yep, okay. I hope this is it. Then I have to sit through more loading screens. <sighs> do, do, do. So many triangles in this game. I'm not quite sure where the triangle motif comes from. Nope! I don't think this is it. But I have never done this, so... Huh. Okay. Let's do this! Wow, airtime! Yeah! Oh, I'm supposed to drift through all of those. Okay, let's try that again. Awesome! Okay, that was fun. Hey, I actually think I'm getting somewhat competent at this. He lied right before he hit something. <laughs> Where does this go? Oh, this is where I started from. Whoa! Oh, I had no idea where I was going. Am I stuck? I'm completely stuck. <laughs> Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay. Well, that was a disaster. Seventh. <laughs> well, that went well. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Very interesting is all I can say. Alright. Let's see if there's anything else interesting to do here. I mean, there's there's a regular rally stuff, but I already did the... Uh, Head to head, it's rally, rally, cross, trailblazer. Those are those all three are kind of the same thing. Yeah, that land rush. Head to head is kind of interesting. It's basically a race with stuff. Actually, let's just do a regular rally because there are different cars that you can use. Um, yes. Okay, so you can have. 60s, 70s, 80s, Group B, 90s, S2000, Open, or Pro. Um, go with Open. Oh, never mind. Let's go with 70s. Old 70s rally cars. A Fiat or an Opel Cadet. Well, the Opal has more power and less weight, so guess I'll go with it. That is a nice livery. I quite liked that. Please show me a picture of my car. Show me the car. Thank you. Ah, that's, that's quite nice. I love those wheels. And that ground clearance. Mm. Glorious. Alright, let's do some racing. In a rear wheel drive. Oh, it's still on automatic transmission mode. Oh well. Maybe I won't fail so hard this time. Probably will, but maybe I won't. Uh, 
Ah, yes, now I have a co-driver to ignore, because I never really... I, I, sh I have a problem. I should probably listen to my co-driver more. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Um, lesson learned about the Opal Cadet. The rear end wants to come around, and no amount of, tor of opposite lock will prevent that. Or just my complete lack of momentum. Wow, okay, yeah. Sliding is not an option in this. You just have to power through the corners. You can't, you can't slide. It's just not possible. Which is kind of annoying. Means I, I guess I'll just have to drive the way that I would on a, uh, not rally race. Tarmac race on a road course, I suppose. Not really sliding, just trying to hit the apexes of the corners and drive through fast. Though, honestly, eh. There's a, there's a decent amount of sideways in Rally. I don't watch Rally that much. I'm not an expert by any means. It's probably my favorite kind of racing, and yet it's the one that I'm the least educated about. So, uh, yay for that. Airtime. I'm really glad this game doesn't give you points for airtime or drifting or anything ridiculous like that. I mean, it, it it's an arcadey game, but it's a serious arcadey game. Oh, even there, I almost lost it. Oh, I I hardly. Oh, whoops! Don't cut. Sorry. Cheeky woman. Okay, go up some switchbacks here. Bit of break, bit of gas. It just wants to come around no matter what. Interesting. Is this is this rear engine? Mid rear engine? I thought I thought this was a front engine car. It really shouldn't do that. It should, if anything, you should understeer like a freaking pig. I thought this was I really thought this had the engine in the front, but it doesn't handle like that. Crap! Okay. Yay! Oh, what was that? Was I not supposed to go through that? Where was I supposed to go then? Fifth! Yeah. Awful. Alright, well, that is Dirt 3. That is a pretty fun game, and it's really cheap. I suggest you pick it up if you have any passing interest even in rally racing. One minor annoyance, like the only negative thing about this, is it is a Windows Live game, so you're going to be getting... You know, you have to install Windows Live, though it, it wasn't a big deal to install the game since it's through Steam. And it'll ask you for some sign-in information every now and then, which I don't believe you actually have to do. So, minor quibbles, really, really good game. Suggest you go pick it up, and I will see you in the next video.